Hello YouTube. Recently, Russian scientists have discovered something very unusual. The paleontological find is hidden under a thick layer of gypsum and petrified, but very fragile, an awkward movement and a piece that is older than the dinosaurs breaks off. The scientists determined the approximate aged based on the composition of the rock. This fossilized part of something as yet unexplored belongs to the Devonian period, Paleozoic era. The first dinosaurs appeared only in the Triassic and humans, well, in their quaternary period. But if we still talk about the age, then this find is 385 million years old. Something incomprehensible was found in the current quarry of the Leningrad region. For its beauty, it is also called the Luga Maldives. Or Maldives, the snow white sand washed to the area from the shores of the Devonian Sea and with it the paleontological enigma. For eight days without a break for rest and lunch, St. Petersburg scientists dug up a prehistoric tree stump, first with a pickaxe, then with brushes. Each fragment was thoroughly dried, moistened with glue and special treatment. It is incredibly interesting because it is a unique thing. Before that, we had neither in the Luga district nor anywhere near it, nor in the Leningrad region. Such finds are practically unknown in Russia, and any new find is new information said Dmitry Grigoryev, head of the St. Petersburg State University Paleontological Museum. What was the world like 380 million years ago? Who lived in the territory of the modern Leningrad region? Paleobotanists do not rule out that school textbooks will have to be amended. If it's not the stump of a petrified tree, then what or who? Similar organisms belong to the mysterious group of prototaxites, which some researchers consider to be fungi or fungi. Some plants and some symbiotic organisms like lichens, says Anna Lubarova, a junior scientist at the Laboratory of Paleobotany of the Russian Academy of Sciences. Maybe as a result of these studies, we will understand that this is something so unique that it is some kind of separate group, a dead end line of evolution, according to Sergei Snigirevsky, candidate of geological and mineralogical sciences, senior lecturer at the Department of Sedimentary Geology of St. Petersburg State University. The entire find will be collected in the Paleontological Museum, of which it will later become an exhibit. There simply won't be enough space in the laboratories of the St. Petersburg State University. One and a half meters wide, it will not fit through any doors. But on the other hand, the fossil will be included in the chronicle of the origin of life on Earth, which many will want to read. I will tell you more about this very unusual find and who or what it belonged to. And if you like my research, please support to the links you find in the description to this video. Please like my videos, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for your attention to my work.